Take a look at this VR comfort strap. It replaces the strap on your Quest 2, and it's made by Kujek here. I think I bought it for $45 Canadian off Amazon. It comes in a small box. Like, wow. Look at all the pieces inside here. So you get all kinds of pieces here. This is a strap. This is the Velcro thing here. And the instructions. So we'll piece all this together and we'll start the video. So there's actually 10 parts to this uh, Elite strap. And we're going to look at each one of them. So we laid it out the way that it's laid out in the instruction book. So you know what, what part is what. So number one, we're talking about this here part here. That's the middle head strap frame structure. And number two, we talk about number two here. Number two is the upper head strap here. Number three is the lower head strap here. And then the round buckles here, there's a left and a right. And then they talk about the long strips here. These are the left and the right. Two sponge pads. This is one for the back of that headset. This is already on here. And they talk about this here strap here. So all the parts are there. And you have a left and a right written right on here. There's the L for left. And you have to make sure you put right to right, left to left. There's the R for that one. The buckles have the same thing. They have a left and a right. There's the right here. And there's the left here. So we'll put it all together. So they want you to use the middle head strap, which is number one here. They want you to rotate the knob on the back of that head strap counterclockwise to extend the, the band. So counterclockwise is going this way. Here's your knob in the back here. It's going to extend these two arms counterclockwise. This is step one now. So the second step here is, is to pick up the round buckle, long strip buckle, the letter L, and find the corresponding left arm. The, it says in brackets here, the L icon is not obvious. Look for it carefully. So you have three L's to worry about. Here's the first one. Here's the buckle here. That's L with the buckle. Here's the long strip. And you've got L written on here. And in the inside of this strap, there's the L here. I don't know if you can see it. Very hard to see. So we have all three. So this is the L one. And we're going to put the, the wrong piece on here with that strap in the side here. It can only go one way because this part here is going to go on your Quest 2 here. Like here. It's going to snap on here. I want it to go one way. So it says in the next part of the instructions to hook it all up here. There's going to be a, it'll, you line the round hole up with the long strip and then on the buckle itself, the long buckle. And then this cap has four little feet that snap in and it lines with that hole, snap it all together. So what you're going to do is it's going to put this like this here, line up the hole. And on the back of this is a one little peg there that'll snap into here. And there's four little pieces that'll snap into here, locking in place. So you line up that hole there, then you got to line up the center hole here. And the neat thing about it, it's got it's, it's written on here, so we have an idea where to line it up here. Just put it inside here, snap it in place here. There, it's in. That's the left side. Do the right side now. So here's your right side, line up that hole here. And kind of line it up so that these feet are open. You can put this clip on here. This. It's kind of hard to get them all in at once here. Let me do it off camera. Finally got it in here. It's kind of hard to... Uh, Look through the camera and try to line it up. So it's all in here. It's all snapped in here. The four pieces here, the four pieces here that all snapped in here and inside here as well. Same on the left side here. They're all snapped in and all secure there now. 
So that goes in the side of your, your headset on your Quest 2 there. Now I'll do the next part. So the uh, number two is the upper head strap frame structure. Talk about that. I'm not going to talk about putting it in the top part of this. So you see what this here is. In order to go one way, the other straps are longer. So it only goes one way. When you line it up here, you line it up so that it snaps in here. And these two holes, it shows you pushing the arrow going this way. And then these two holes will line up. So I'll put it in like this. Like that. Then we pull it back here. And they're lined up. See the two lines are lined up here? It's only on one side here. Right here. That's lined up. So number three here is the lower head strap. It's longer than the top one here. And we're going to put it on the bottom. And it shows here. Put it in place, slide it into place, and then Line up the two circles here. There's one here and this one on here. So again, you're looking at here. There's a bit of a groove in here. And there's grooves in, in the... So line it up here, both sides. It's going to slide it in place here. So they line up. That's in place now. So the uh, two circles lined up here. Now that's in place. So the headset is complete now. Now we're going to put the uh, the strap on and the Velcro on. So then it says to put your Velcro on the corresponding shape. Uh, the bottom one doesn't have the Velcro on it. So that's, this piece will cover both this and as well as this. So I'll kind of line it up. Put your Velcro in here. So both these are, you can take both these off. This one as well, it's Velcro down to wash them. The last part is put the strap in. Now the strap's got two different ends, square here, kind of a round end. So you put it in this way, in the bottom here, just thread it through here. Then you're going to put it on your Quest 2 here. So we're going to take the old straps off the uh, Oculus Quest 2 and right here, see where that dividing line is here, you're going to pull that away gently here and it'll come off. Here it comes off there now. That's one side. Do the other side. Same thing here. You see the dividing line here. Just pull it easy here. That's off. Now you can take the interface plate off. Just pulls that off. That's off. Now I'll take the strap off. The Velcro off. Just slide it through here. That's off, put the new mask on, the new clip on. Well, you got everything off, good time to clean your lenses here. This uh, cloth got my glasses, so that worked well. So the first thing to do is put your strap in, the new strap in here. Just thread it through here in the bottom. Then we'll adjust it after. Put the sides in next. So just hook the end on the side here, kind of pull it forward, and then try to snap it in here. That side's done. So hook it on the end here, get it started here. And then pull it to the side here. Everything's died. There it goes. That's in now. That's for my uh, anchor, the charge port. And put your faceplate back in. Now, this original one, I bought a different one. I'm going to do a video on that coming up here. Snap that back in here. Just click.
thicken, please. There. Everything back together now. We've got the faceplate in, we've got the two sides in. And then the, the strap here, make sure the round part here comes through up here. And just leave it fully extended to adjust it on your face. And then turning at the back here is going to tighten it. Next step, try it on. So today we tried the Kujet and uh, worked fairly well. I I gotta admit that uh, I would like this to move, like a little bit of movement in this, so I can move the headband down. Uh, but it does work. It does make a better job than the original Quest two straps that we have here. Uh, you're gonna see a lot. The graphics a lot easier, yeah, and more clearer because your face piece is tight against your face, and you're not gonna have, have that wiggling. And when you're walking, when you're doing your game, so that's a big difference. And just tightening it in the back here is so easy. And the Velcro strap is okay. It's very thin, but it's okay. And uh, so, yeah, I would recommend it. It's probably better ones out there. But I like the way that it hugs you at the back of your head here. It's got two forms here, so it makes a nice, comfortable. I did play Dread, dread uh, Halls with it. And it's even spookier with the song, because you can see the graphics a lot better so uh, ring that bell and share my video because there'll be more videos coming out You'll be notified and next time I'll be looking at this AMVR it's the uh, interface that goes here this is the original one so this is supposed to be a lot better one it has vents on the top here so that'll make a difference and uh, it does fit in my anchor system here too so everything's okay with this new headset. I'd like to thank all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Thanks so much for subscribing to my channel. Watch this the first time today. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video today, people. Have a great day.